Hey y'all, Matt here from Super Niche Sites. In the video today, I'm going to be going over my earnings from December. Now I'm a couple weeks late. I was on, went on a vacation, went to see family over the holidays, that sort of thing. Didn't get back until after the 1st of January. And of course, you know, anytime you go on a decently long trip, this one was about 10, 11 days or so for us you know when you come back there's a lot of work to do so showing you a new part of the property that we own here and my truck down over there so you can see i'm not a millionaire driving a lamborghini just a normal guy who does the amazon influencer program and so today i just want to kind of go over my earnings for december comparing them to november just to kind of give you an idea what is possible with the amazon influencer program now if you've never watched any of my other videos in the past i've only been doing the amazon influencer program for about six months and when i say the amazon influencer program specifically i'm talking about on-site video placement so i'm talking about making videos uploading them to amazon amazon places them on the product pages and on a variety of other different pages and then i make money when people click watch those videos and then purchase something so today's video i'm just going to be covering some general numbers for the month of december unfortunately i can't show you my amazon dashboard it's against amazon's terms it's proprietary information information blah 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 but essentially it's was less than what i was expecting in regards to what i made in november i was expecting december to actually be up a little bit but after looking into it a little bit, little bit i kind of figured out pretty easily why so in the month of december i'm not going to bury the lead or anything i made right around ten thousand five hundred dollars now six months into something that i started as a side hustle that's absolutely amazing like i'm definitely not upset about making that but it was down a little bit from november november i made somewhere around twelve thousand dollars or so from the different things that i did from the on-site and from a couple of different affiliate programs that i'm in that i make additional money through amazon and through on-site and you know made videos for people that sort of a thing so i did make a make some additional but it was around twelve thousand in november now my sales were actually higher in december than they were in november because sales were good all month but the main reason why I made more in November was because in November, Amazon was running a specific promotion that some influencers got invited to, and I happened to be one of those. And so because of that, I was able to make some additional percentages on different sales through on-site, through affiliate, through that sort of thing. And this was all just specifically through on-site. And so I was able to make some additional money on virtually every sale that I made in November, which included Black Friday, Cyber Monday, those big sale days. And so that allowed me to have a higher income in November than I did in December. But still, 10,500, I didn't feel like was too bad for the month of December. Now it's currently mid-January, and obviously in mid-January, you know, it's going to go down compared to December, compared to November. It's not the holiday season. There's not big sale days, anything like that. But so far I'm about 10, 11 days or so as of this recording. And I'm at like $25, $2,600 for the month of January. So I'm expecting it to be somewhere around half of December once it all shakes out. Every day is gonna be different. No day is gonna be the same. So I'm expecting it to be around 5,000 or so for the month of January. We'll, we'll, I'll get to that, you know, in February, I'll put out a video going over my earnings, but just showing where I'm at so far in the, in the first part of January. Now, a couple of things about the Amazon influencer program, specifically on-site placement, it is going to be a bit of a roller coaster. Obviously, you know, November was 12,000. That's amazing. December was 10,000. And if I'm expecting it to be the same going into January and I'm cut in half, then obviously that's going to be a big shot in the gut. But you have to understand that holiday season for anything whether you run websites if you run e-commerce stores if you sell on amazon if you do those sorts of things around the holiday season you're going to have a lot more income coming in and so you have to be understand that you have to be prepared for that i knew that going in i've been making a living online for quite a while i just started on site six months ago but i've done amazon affiliate off and on through blogs and through building websites and things like that over quite a few years now so i knew you know november december were going to be great and then head into January it's going to drop but truthfully if I end up at that 5,000 or so mark like I'm kind of expecting to that's still a really really great month in regards to compared to what I was doing prior to November December like I was hitting 3,500 4,000 maybe 4,500 so January being 5,000 plus I'm expecting is it is definitely going to be pretty good for what I'm doing and what I've got going on so far now I do want to mention here before I end this video that 
I am continuing to reinvest into the program. I've done a video on how I do my, my research for finding products to buy here on the channel. So feel free to go and check that out. I've done videos going step-by-step step showing exactly how I do that and the process that I go through and all of that sort of a thing. So I don't just only do things around my house. That's how I started out. But then after I was in the program for it was a few weeks, a few months, can't remember, maybe a month, a, a little while. Um, I realized, man, if I'm making this much money just from doing stuff around my house, what can I do if I actually start to reinvest money? And so I started doing that. I'm still doing that now into the, in the month of January. However, I have switched it up a little bit. I was spending um, pro probably the first few months, I was spending close to 100% of everything I got from on-site on it and into reinvesting new products and then of course they did run like bonuses and things like that that amazon does from time to time and randomly and here and there and blah 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 they sometimes you'll get invited to sometimes you won't and so i was investing probably reinvesting close to 50 percent now january i've cut that down a ways i was doing around 30 percent but I'm currently getting backed up. Like my kids were off school a couple of days last week because they were sick. So it made it where I couldn't could do videos last week. And so right now I've got a giant pile of stuff that I need to get through. And so that's the project for today, this week, um, you know, going, going through the rest of this month. So I've stopped buying until I can get through that backlog a little bit. But I just wanted to mention that that is what I do. So that has helped me to increase my earnings, kind of take my earnings to the next level in regards to being able to do that in just six months. Now I do try and post regularly here on the channel. I try and do it every week, but again, got out of it just because I was gone for 10 days and came back and there was so much to get caught up on. And it's taken me two weeks or so to get mostly caught up on stuff around the house and you know things with the kids getting back into school and getting back in the groove and the schedule, schedule of everything and all of that stuff going on. So I do try and post regularly. So I would appreciate a like and a subscribe if that's something that you're interested in, in learn about the Amazon Influencer Program. I'm just a normal guy. As you can see, I'm just walking around here I've got a barn behind me, a bunch of junk laying over here on the side that was here when we bought the property. You know, I've got a little tractor parked right behind me, a house up on the hill. So I'm not a multi-millionaire or anything like that. Just a normal guy who started this six months ago. I'm not a major influencer or a major person who's got millions of followers on YouTube or TikTok or anything like that. I'm just a normal guy. So if I can do it, you can do it as well. So I hope that this video has been a little bit helpful, just kind of explaining what is possible with this program to you and also maybe giving you a couple little things that you can consider if you're considering getting into the Amazon Influencer Program. My name is Matt. I'm from Super Niche Sites, and I hope you have a great rest of your day.